Hey everyone, how you doing? It's uh, Daniel Oakley here. Pure Oakley 01. Uh, this is going to be an update video. Um, seems as I haven't done one for ages and ages. Basically because nothing's really happened, to be honest. So I'll start with my, um, my personal favourite out of all of my, my pets. You can see him. I'm getting on to it a bit. So this here is Kratos, my salmon pink bird eater. Come on. Uh, he has molted, but unfortunately I don't have the actual the previous skin. He is about, let's see if I can get him in, in inches. Uh, he's about two and a half inches. There or thereabouts. Getting big. Very bulky. Very, very large abdomen. Uh, so, yeah. He's doing good. I don't know if I'll be able to. Uh, So yeah, he's about two and a half inches, roughly. Uh, like I said, he's more, he's got bigger in bulk. He's a lot more fatter and that, rather than length. Uh, over there, we have Petra. My other summer pink. Um, I did just get her out, well, out of her little hide away and measured her. She's about two centimetres to two and a half. Um, as I always say, I got both of these spiderlings when they were about three quarters of a centimetre. So um, I bought them three weeks apart and they I had them both at the same size. And uh, yeah, I said she's about two to two and a half centimetre. He's now what well, about six six centimeters so not so yeah definitely a big difference in size for those two uh, those two spiders and here we have legion it's a bit awkward to get him out there he is. I do want to get a bigger enclosure because I was told that this would be uh, okay for him, but I want to get a bigger one anyway. Come on. There you go. Okay then. So this is Legion. One good thing about this, I have sexed her. It's a female. Um, looking on the internet. I also looked on John 3800's How to Sex a Tarantula and Scorpion videos and uh yeah be careful yeah, he's gone back in um, on the underside of their body about there is a little, uh, like a little V shape. It's like an upside down one, and it's like a little bug wings. I don't know. So like, like like a vent, I suppose. And uh, yeah, I managed to get her upside down and had a look at her, and definitely a female. Uh, got absolutely no doubt about it. Come on. A bit awkward to you know get this one because uh, obviously holding the camera, <laughs> my phone rather. 
I shall leave you in there. I'll get you out in a minute. I'll let you have a cool around. But a brilliant scorpion. Uh, it is the giant forest scorpion. Can be quite defensive at times, but usually it's perfectly fine to handle. Okay then. Uh, I'm doing a video, so just give me two minutes. All right. Uh, over here we have Septum, my uh, Beast Mithy, the Mexican Rendy. Uh, let me see if I can get this one out because this is actually another. Well, I won't be able to use built it up. Um, probably another one of my favourites. Um, I don't really have a favourite, but I have a small collection, so it's sort of. Uh, there are certain characteristics of the spiders that I like. Uh, this one, in here, this um, is my pink zebra beauty, the come status, and this one was always called Satan. Uh, however, I will be renaming her. See, she's all curled up. She's about three inches. Uh, well, you know, she's not that big, but three and a half with her legs out. She has got a bold spot there, but this one is a uh, come on, good girl. I think this one's a female as well. It's got a, sort of a, a little line across there. Oops. There you go. She has gone all defensive with the abdomen up, but your leg in. There you go. So yeah. I will be renaming her. I can't call her Satan. It's any recommendations or well ideas for a name for her? I said it's that I'm sure it's a female. So it's got the little slit. Um, okay then. Up here is my Pogletheria rufulata, the red slate ornamental. Here it is. Might have to just see it. I think it's going into malt again. It hasn't been eating, which is odd. Normally I put food in and it's gone like straight away. I know you probably can't see it because of the, uh, the camera. But it's all webbed up and she's making a, a mat. Big web. Hopefully, I can get it to uh, to come out a bit. Oh, there she is. You can see the colours. She's really bright, uh, brightly coloured, yellow all over. I wish I could show you better what she's doing, although I can't, uh, I can't really see too well myself because of the, uh, the web and stuff. Oh, I've got 30 seconds left. So quickly, here is a, where is it, there it is. Here's Titan, my Goliath Bird Eater, who's a, uh, yeah, same old, same old. <laughs> no mold in yet. Alright, cut it quick. Uh, yeah, cheers for watching, guys. Uh, I'll do more soon. Cheers.